can deal maybe with a little bit of rain and temperatures that have been overall really pleasant for the weekend. Taking a look though, cold front has pushed through. It is moving off to the east, taking with it any of the widespread rain. So what we are left with, just some spotty areas of showers remaining as this cold front works its way through. But many of you probably got in on some of those brief heavy downpours earlier. All that's left right now, lighter to moderate showers. Terrell getting in on that. Greenville check, can, taking a look as we push off to the east. You can see, again, most of it a little bit lighter at this point. These showers moving off to the east, southeast. And as we push down a little bit further south, places like Athens, Palestine, you've gotten in on some of the lighter leftover rain. Now, how much have we gotten from this? Again, keep in mind. We do still have some locations with moderate drought, so a little rain would do us good. And we did get some locations up to half of an inch. Collin County seeing some of those higher amounts, as well as down around Corsicana over to Athens as well. So we did see, at least in our eastern counties, a little bit more rainfall from that. Not so much as you got west of I-35. Our temperatures will continue to fall off tonight. This is not a drastically colder air mass, but it is slightly cooler. You can see those 40s showing up off to the west, where we've got the clouds and rain left over. Temperatures a little bit higher, steady through tonight until after midnight. 56 Terrell. Sulphur Springs there at 56, and cooler off to the west, Bridgeport 50, Bowie at 47. Rest of tonight, look for drier weather to start to push in after midnight. Temperatures falling into the low 40s as we wake up tomorrow, so certainly you'll want to grab that jacket. A live look right now from Dallas. You can see some of those low clouds sticking around, even some fog and spots. Temperatures are still hanging in the 50s. We have already had that wind shift, so signifying cold front has come through. A little bit of a breeze and mentioning the fog. Now, this does not look to stay with us all night, but back off to the east where that drier air behind the front hasn't come through, you've got a little bit of fog to deal with, at least for the time being. Better as you get off to the west, and I do expect all of us to improve over the next couple of hours. Any rainfall pushing off to the east as we get into tomorrow morning, we are talking about a nice sunny day ahead. We'll see high pressures start to build back in. That'll mean a sunny day, a little bit cooler tomorrow. Temperatures slightly warmer as we get into Tuesday, and it looks like the warmest comes into play Wednesday. We're talking upper 60s there for a really nice midweek forecast. 42 tonight, rain's coming to an end, a cool night ahead, and tomorrow 58 degrees. So again, just a touch cooler than 62. What we got to today, Tuesday, Wednesday, temperatures are climbing. A dry cold front comes through Thursday. That'll make for a colder weekend next weekend.